Hello, I'm Dr. Shaylin Buck for the DeKalb Medical Minute. Many conditions bring patients to DeKalb Medical's Heart and Vascular Institute, and some require that patients are given a stress test. Let's hear from DeKalb Medical's Dr. Mutaya Srinivasan about what that entails. A stress test is most often done to evaluate if there's any concern to the blood flow to your heart. In addition, the doctor may ask you to undergo a stress test to evaluate your cardiovascular fitness before prescribing exercise and also to evaluate if uh, heart arrhythmias that you have can be worsened after exercise. The most common stress test is an exercise stress test, but for those patients with chronic airway problems, severe arthritis, or abnormal resting heart rates, their doctor may order a stress test done with medications to simulate exercise. These tests help doctors evaluate whether there are blockages of blood flow to the heart before, during, or after exercise, or simulated exercise. The resting blood flow is measurably affected only when a person has a blockage of 90% or more. However, when a person has a blockage of 70% or more, there can be significant reduction in blood flow to the heart, especially during activities, and this can lead to heart attacks. When a patient has an abnormal stress test, we would uh, coordinate performing a cardiac catheterization with the DeKalb Heart and Vascular Institute. Uh, since DeKalb Medical Center offers all services in one roof, it is very convenient for the patient uh, and the patient can have these services by the same care providers. The nursing staff is excellent and the facilities are close to home. Thanks for watching this DeKalb Medical Minute. For more information on treatment of heart and vascular disease, watch our other videos online. Just a few minutes of your time can save your life.